In order to have good quality soil, you want to make sure that it has the right balance of nutrients. And the way to tell that is with the soil test. Here in a garden that's been rototilled quite a bit or spaded and the soil turned over, you can simply take a scoop out of the soil and have a pretty good representative sample of what the plants are growing in. However, when you go out into a lawn area or perhaps an orchard where the soil isn't mixed, you want to get a vertical core of soil. You can do that by taking a scoop out of the side of a hole with a shovel, cutting the sides away, and then putting this sample into a clean plastic bucket. You do this in a number of different areas, mix them up, and that gives you a good composite or average of what the soil is like. If you just take one sample, it might be a place where a rover stopped last year, and that might throw your soil sampling off quite a bit. You want to use a clean plastic bucket. If it's had fertilizer in it and hadn't been washed out, of course, that'll throw your sample off as well. Then take the composite out of the bucket and place it in a soil sample bag. Now the extension office, your county agent, has various types of soil samples, the standard bags and then one that's used more often for lawn and gardens. Whichever type you use, you'll send the sample off to the lab and for about ten dollars the results will come back to you and to your agent as well. So if you'd like to call them on the phone and discuss what additions might be necessary, you can do that. With your common sense tip on sampling your soil, I'm Skip Richter.